Hello YouTube! That's how we start things around here. Hello YouTube! Today we're coming at you with a live, but not really live, uh, unboxing of a Stitch Fix box for myself. Is that how we're starting this? <laughs> Hello and welcome! My name is Jocelyn and today I am joined by my husband Alex. My name's Alex. Nice to meet you. And uh, we've done these videos on my channel before and today we are doing them again. We are unboxing his Stitch Fix. If you are not familiar with what Stitch Fix is, I will be going or we will be going over a brief overview of what Stitch Fix is. But if you are very familiar with how it works and all of that jazz, then uh, there will be a timestamp on the screen to where you can jump in the video to see what Alex got in his Stitch Fix styling box. For those of you who want a little bit more information, Stitch Fix is a styling subscription service where you sign up, you fill out a style profile. So Alex has filled out a style profile. You tell them your sizes, your preferences, things you never want to receive, things that you want to receive frequently. So the boxes can include all kinds of pieces of clothing, shirts, shorts, jackets, jackets. swim trunks, shoes, shoes, necklaces, purses. Yep. Almost everything that you can put on your body you could receive in your styling box. So you fill out your style profile. Again, it's very, very in-depth. And then you schedule your first fix, like this one right here. This is my third one. Is it only your third? Fourth, fourth one. This is the, the third one I think unboxed. we've unboxed on yeah. the channel. He did get one other one, but we didn't have time I to I just film tore it. right into it. Can yeah. We... <laughs> so once you schedule your fix, you do pay a $20 styling fee to Stitch Fix. And that $20 does get applied towards anything you choose to keep in your box. So you pay the $20, a stylist puts together five pieces, ships your box to you, you open up your box, you try all of the pieces on, and then you decide what you wanna keep and what you wanna send back. Stitch Fix does supply a mailer inside of your box to mail everything back so you don't have to pay for shipping there or back. It's all free, which is great. So you ship back anything that you choose not to keep and then you pay for everything you choose to keep and again, that $20 styling fee does get applied towards anything that you choose to keep. I am an affiliate with Stitch Fix. That's a recent thing, so which is very exciting for me and for Alex, I think. So I do have an affiliate code down below that you can use it to get to the Stitch Fix site and create a profile. Just so you know, it is an affiliate code, which means I do earn a little bit of commission if you click on that link. And we do appreciate it because any income that we get from that affiliate link does go back into Stitch Fix unboxing so Alex and I can continue our lovely journey with Stitch Fix and potentially keep some of the things that we get in our boxes. Because I do also unbox Stitch Fix on my channel. I will leave my most recent one down in the comments below and I should have another one coming this next week. So my unboxing should be showing up real fast here on my channel. So without further ado, if we forgot anything, or I guess if I forgot anything because I've been talking this whole entire time, I'll leave it down in the description below so that you can check it out. Speaking of Stitch Fix things that you keep in your box, this shirt I actually got oh, yeah. in my most recent box, and the shorts that I'm wearing, which you can't see right now, I also got in that same box. So I love the things I get in my Stitch Fix. It's very personalized. You can choose to keep your stylist or change it up. Yes. Uh, I've had my same stylist, can't remember her name, but it'll be on the card here in a second. But regardless, I've had her the whole time and you get to write comments back on why you didn't like certain items and they really work with you to the feedback helps dial you in your style. Yeah. All right, so we are gonna unbox the stitch fix. So we got our mailer, as Jocelyn said, so you can ship anything back you don't want or exchange. Oh yeah, they offer exchanges. I've done the, that. This is the envelope with all the information. So we'll hold we got on to prices that. in here and style guides and a note from his stylist. As per usual, I'm gonna just be making eye contact with the camera while I dive in for my first item. Ooh. Okay, Jocelyn's excited. Okay, Ooh. Uh, this feels like a dress shirt. Feel collar. Whoa. Okay, might be a little hard to see through in the camera. Real fine print here. I like that print a lot. Oh, this feels really nice. Yeah. So this first dress shirt is by Bixie Nomad. It is their Odyssey washed shirt in size large. And it looks like a nice dress shirt. Nice color. Can't wait to try it on. Yeah. Moving on. Oh, I like that. To a nice, nice. soft. Ooh. I feel like I got something really similar to this and I sent it back and I don't know why now that I'm looking at no, this. No, I don't think you got something like I'm this. I'm liking this. This is, well, I don't know how well you guys can see it. It's a collared 
shirt with it looks like a couple of buttons right there in a pocket it, but it's really really soft it feels like a really comfortable material yeah. this it's is like by, heathered all throughout yeah flag and anthem the gibson slub one pocket polo so like a polo. say that five times fast it was a lot all right moving on Third item, another t-shirt here. Okay, we got some nice little, cute little buttons here in the front. In case you couldn't tell, I really like dark neutral tones and my stylist knows that. This is by the brand Threads for Thought. The Baseline Tri-Blend Henley, again in a size large. This is nice. Whoa! look, whoa, wait, are those swim trunks? Kind of. Maybe not. Wait, maybe. Yeah. Really? They're like swim Swim casual. Shorts. Yeah. Like they feel like swim trunks, but they don't look like swim trunks. But they trunks. look like shorts. Yeah. That's the new thing. Really? That's what's popular. So you could swim in these? Oh, yeah. You could take these rafting tomorrow? Yeah. Tomorrow. So these are by the brand Rye. They're the 11.5 Lincoln Hybrid Short. Hybrid. So I thought, okay, that makes sense. Yep. These are going to be expensive. I already know. But wow, they feel worth it. <laughs> and it looks like another pair of denim. Ooh. It's not a stitch fix boxing if I don't get a pair of denim. This is true. And I have been looking for a black pair of denim, and I hope that these are the ones for me. All right, so these are by the brand Warp and Weft, the CPH Copenhagen Tailored Jean in size 32. Clearly black. Black? They look like a so slim black. fit. Yep, they are. And they feel just real comp already. They do. Oh, my I'm really God. excited about this box. Which one do you want to do first? Style guide or... Price. Style guide. Okay. All right, so in all of the stitch fixes, we do have a style guide. In here, you have all of the pieces that were sent to you and just kind of how to style them, what to pair them with. I really think it's really helpful. Yeah. Um, and then you also get a note from your stylist, so we'll read that real fast. Haley is her name. All right, so bring on the prices. Here we go. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Okay, Justin feels good. I, That's good. Th yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. So talk to me about the jeans. Those are the first thing on this, and definitely the most expensive. I'm gonna guess eighty-eight dollars. No. Okay, seventy-four. Yeah, exactly. Yes, seventy-four. Ding, 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 ding! You get them for free. <laughs> I wish. They feel amazing, though. They feel really good. And yeah. then if I if I had this pair of jeans, I would be absolutely set on jeans. I'd yeah. have like my three, no, four other pair, and then a black pair, like. You wouldn't need any more stitch fix jeans. Nope, I would tell Haley, no more jeans, please. All right. Um, Talk to me about the shorts. So those are the second most expensive. You're and right. And they're going to be 66. No. 58. No. 48. So close. Oh, 49. 49. Yep. Which you knew they were going to be expensive. 49 for those. All right. Yeah. But these are like things those you wear really every day. Those are really nice. Yeah. And they're really, really good. Good color. Yeah. Nice and those stretchy. Are cool. All right. Now. Get in brand. Is that the threads for thought? Yep. Baseline. That's Henley. the cheapest thing. This is the cheapest thing. This is just yeah. a standard. It's called the baseline. But uh, I really, really like nice. this style of collar and the three buttons. So I'm going to guess this is 23 bucks. <laughs> no. 32. $34? Dang it. That's the cheapest thing. Oh man, I don't know how I feel about these next two items now. I love that. I'm excited to see that on you. You love this, huh? I do really like that a lot. Flag, Flag and anthem. anthem. Okay. Uh, 40. Exactly. Yep. Ding, 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 ding. Another winner. <laughs> Another one for free. All right, that one. The Bixby Nomad. Wait, two bucks, 44? Nope. Keep going. 47. Nope, so Four, close. 48. 48. I don't know how I feel about this one. This is definitely like number five. All right, so if you had to rate them right now. The shorts, the jeans, the everyday, the other collared, and then, and then this, this guy. One. Really? <laughs> the shorts before the jeans? Is it because yeah. of price? Because it's summer. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. But All I right. mean, I want them, I like them both. So the total price of your box is $245. If this is something we forgot to mention at the beginning. If you choose to keep everything in the box, you do get a 25% discount on everything. Which can be hefty. Which, yeah, which would be $61.25. So um, a grand total of like 180 183.75, yeah. Okay. And then again, your styling credit gets applied to that total. So. Yeah, so I've already paid 20 bucks, so that would take that 180-something to 160-something. Yeah, yeah. So, mm -hmm. all right, time to try things on. These shorts are awesome. <laughs> Rip. <laughs> and then this is the Threads for Thoughts baseline. That looks pretty comfortable. It's very comfortable. It's really soft. It's not as soft as you think. Oh, really? Yeah, but it is really comfortable. Love the button look. The buttons look, it, look, it takes it from just a regular old t-shirt to... A little something extra. Mm-hmm. These shorts are my color. Those are a good color. I like those. Is the shirt too long? No. I don't oh, okay. like long shirts. Yeah. I don't like a shirt that's too short. Okay. These are a definite keep. All right. On to the next look. 
All right, well, as awesome of a color as these jeans are and as flexible as they are, they are tad too tight for me. I used to wear my jeans this skinny when I was in high school. And skinnier. <laughs> and even skinnier, yes. But uh, nowadays I like them a little more loose. They're honestly, they're flexible enough. Like, I feel like I could still do anything in them, but they're just, they're just too skinny for me. It's not my look anymore. So the jeans are gonna be a no, sad, because they are like the perfect, just really dark shade of black. They feel really comfortable. They're soft and flexible. Everything I'm looking for in a black pair of jeans, except. They're just a little bit too snug. <laughs> they're too snug. So that's okay. But moving on to this shirt, I really like it. It's really comfortable. It's like kind of more of a dress casual. That's true. I don't feel like you have... So I wouldn't wear it all the time, but if I needed like not super fancy, but looking good, this is definitely an option for that. So looks like it fits good. It's good it color. It's really great. It's really comfortable. Good neutral color. Yeah. So I would like to keep this. Now I just gotta try on this bad boy. All right. Uh, huh. Let's see. I don't really like this this gap. There should be a button right here, you know? I either gotta go all the way, a little too open. Uh, it's a great fit though. Great length, comfortable. I'm not crazy about the pattern. This is a maybe. I need to think about this one. What do you think? It looks good, but I can tell that you're not super excited about it. And I feel like there might be better dress shirts out there for you. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's a good dress shirt and I'd wear it if I had to, but not nope. something I'm like, wow, excited I wanna buy about. that and wear that. And time. your clothing should spark joy. Thank you, Marie Kondo. Probably a no, right? Probably a no. All right, so let's Alex change back into his regular clothing and let's uh, do some final thoughts and a wrap up. And we're back, wow. So that was fun. I tried on some clothes. I liked some and I didn't like some. And here is the final report. Items I'm sending back. These amazing black jeans because they're too darn tight. And this fancy dress shirt. Fits nice, but it's not my style. Items I'm keeping. This. Awesome, casual dress shirt. Yeah, I feel like there's been a lot of times where I've wanted you to be wearing something like this to something, mm -hmm. like a nice dinner that we've gone to that's not like formal, but a nice dinner yeah. for a nice event. This is perfect for something like that. Perfect. This other... Casualty. Yes, this is a little more on the casual side. It doesn't have to call it. It's still nice. But still very nice with, with the, the buttons. buttons. The buttons make it nice. And again, dark neutral tone. And lastly, the piece de resistance, the hybrid shorts. These things are awesome. I've definitely actually always wanted a pair of shorts like this mm. that, you know, just look like standard dress shorts. Or not, not even dress shorts, but just, um, just, just shorts. standard shorts. But they're the real nice waterproof, breathable, stretchable material. material. So, very excited about that. And that's my stitch fix. That's what I'm keeping and that's what I got rid of. So the total cost of the three items that he wants to keep is $122. The $20 styling fee that he paid at the beginning of this order does get applied to that $122, so he would only have to pay $102 so, for those three items. Well, I guess he technically paid $122 for those three items, but yeah. right now he only still owes $102. For these three items, I'm really happy with that. Yep. And he does have some credits he's going to use, so thank you so much to everybody who signed up using our referral or affiliate links. It does help us out a lot to be able to use those and continue our service with Stitch Fix because it's fun and it's exciting. It's awesome, yeah. Most, if not, well, all, all of the clothes that we've gotten have become some of our favorite pieces in our wardrobes. Absolutely. So. I don't go out shopping very much, so it's nice to have shopping brought to me. Like, here's <laughs> it some sounds things. like an ad. Here's some clothes. Try them on. We think you'll like them. And most of the time I do like them. <laughs> so with that being said, if you would like to try Stitch Fix, again, I will have an affiliate link down below that you can click on that will bring you to Stitch Fix's website so you can sign up for yourself. If you just want to create a profile and fill out the style profile, you don't have to sign up for a stitch right away, but you can get it started and just kind of get a feel for how it works, but you don't have to put any money out there until you actually schedule a fix. So again, affiliate link down below and thank you to anybody who uses that because you are supporting us and this channel and we thank you so much. All right, and if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you would like to subscribe for more content from me, again, I have a Stitch Fix unboxing that should be right around the corner. Don't forget to do so before you go. All of those buttons are down below and I think that's everything I have for you today. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Are you finally ready for them? Stop filming. Filming Felix. <laughs> oh my god. Look at that.